What's up everyone and welcome to In The Room, the video series where I try a full-on guitar rig and I try to capture the sound of this guitar rig and how it sounds in the room. I'm doing this with the help of different microphones set up at different spots in the room. The idea is to give you a perception of how a full amplifier rig sounds in the room, just as if you were standing right here next to me. And today I'm trying out a classic, a favorite of mine, the dual rectifier from Mesa Boogie. I had a blackface dual rectifier back in the day, it was my first tube amplifier back in the mid 90s and it, it's, it just holds a very very special place in my heart. It just reminds me so much of the 90s. So with the dual rectifier I'm using this guitar, I'm also using an Ibanez Tube Screamer TS9 and a Fortin 33 Pell, I'm also using a cock blocker noise gate. And the microphones I use for this video is a Shure SM58 right there, there's a Neumann TLM 102 over there, both of these are working as closed microphones in this demos. Then I have a Bayer Dynamic Ribbon M160 microphone over there. I have an ORTF stereo microphone over there, basically mimicking a set of ears. And then I have a new Lewitt stereo MS microphone over there. So I think I'm set for a good sesh. Yes, let's just turn it on. No boost engaged at all right now. Okay, let's start with the TS9. I'm on Red Child Modern right now. On the back, the settings are bold and silicon diodes, okay? So the general setup for a rectifier is that I like to keep my tone knobs around 12 o'clock. That's just where I keep my EQ going. Right now, gain is at like 11 o'clock, maybe, and uh, <coughs> presence at 11. This right here, like this incredibly simple setup, rectifier, overdrive, like a Tube Screamer or an OD-808, it just reminds me so much of the 90s, you know, the 90s albums that are out there. It's just such a, such a classic metal tone. Okay, channel 2, vintage. Go back to modern. Yes.
let's try out the 33 pedal. The 33 pedal has a little bit more stank to it. Okay, back to TS9. I personally prefer the TS9 in this case. It's just, it sounds a little bit more rounded off. It just fits better in this case. Really, 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 really satisfying. And while I'm recording these, I mean, obviously, it's really hard to picture how it sounds through the microphones. I, I carefully set them all up, you know, so they should sound good, but it's just really hard to imagine how you would capture something like this, what I'm feeling right here when I'm sitting playing this amp right here. I'm just excited, okay? <laughs> Shit, there it is. That's the Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifier for you. Sounds incredible. For me, it's a very, very familiar sound and it just makes me very, very, very happy. Now, hopefully this will translate well to the recording. I really, really hope so. And uh, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, maybe consider subscribing to my channel. Maybe leave a thumbs up. It helps. Leave a comment, man. That's awesome. Okay, see you guys. Bye.